Alright guys, mission 19, the penultimate mission. So um, are you guys ready for a Capcom Classic? Of course you are. So uh, we're inside the Savior now. We're inside the Savior now. Let that sink in. We're inside the Savior. Oh wow, that brightness hurts my eyes! No, no, besides that, Brian. Well, we also have a silly dice game. We have a silly dice game. Uh... Right, so... Dice game! Hit the dice, wherever it rolls, uh, that's where you go. So, um... Yeah, I'm gonna try to get as little fights as possible. So, one, two, three, four. So, after one. Boop, 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 boop. Fight. Oh, hey. I punched too early. Unless I'm supposed to throw a summon sword at it. Aw oh, man. Well, that was really sloppy. I was trying to show off something, but I completely screwed it up.
Now then, something to learn. If you land on the yellow spot, you immediately go to the end. So, one, two, three, four, five. Three. Okay, so it's after three. Five. See? One, two, three, four, five. Immediately to the end. Yeah, you fight every boss three times in a row. I got really sloppy with that guy. Right, so... Health. One, two, three, four. Four. One, two, three, four. And skipping that all together.
Shut up. Oh, what? Oh, okay. Yeah, he's already dead. <laughs> yep. Re 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 fights. Uh, where's the exit? There it is. So, up next is the, uh, snake lady. <laughs> up next is snake lady. Echidna. Alright, this gives me trigger back. <laughs> Except I didn't need trigger back. So let's see here. One, two, three, four. There we go. Wow, she died horribly. I actually didn't think it was possible for her to die that hard. I honestly did not think it was possible for her to die that hard. Jeez. Goodness, that that was honest. Ah, that's that's glorious. Level three rocket launcher, too good. One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> but you saw what I did to her there. That, that was really unfair. Oh, it's you.
Wow, really? Can you please stop that, sharks? And he's dead. Dead. Oh wow, so much trigger! If only I used my trigger more often. And... Had to. Just like that, we are done with mission 19. Did I just get an S rank? No, A. Okay. And next mission, the final mission. Oh, I f oh, it's about 126. I figured I'd get this done around 130. So, uh... Hi, final boss. What's up? So, a uh, backstory. Uh... This guy was killed by Dante at the beginning, got revived, got Nick got revived, then uh, took off with Nero and Kyrie, did a bunch of stuff, and uh, also, yes, you see right, that is Sparta. That's the ultimate sword from DMC1. That is Dante's father's sword. How the crap he got that? Who the heck knows? So, uh, yeah, he's currently hopped up on demon power with Sparta by his side. We can totally take him. So, yeah, mission 20. This is just a boss fight. It's not gonna last long. Hold on. Gosh dang it, Twitch. Don't do that to my phone.
And you're dead. Goodbye, old man. <laughs> so, yes. I just punched a sword. This isn't even my full power! You're not strong enough. Maybe I'll find out when I get to him on Legendary Dark Knight. Misguided. But soon they shall know this devil's power. A power greater than they ever imagined. The power of a son of Sparta. So, uh, to explain Virgil's storyline, it happens at least a decade before Dante comes to Fortuna. This even happens even before Devil May Cry 3. I think that's an S rank. Yep. Prequel cool doesn't mean you can be a newbie. <laughs> Pretty much the game is like, good job, get better scrub. But yeah, I do love the fact that you can still counter the boss's attack when you're not narrow, because in order to counter that attack as narrow, you have to, uh, buster the sword. Mm. 
aka using his uh, devil arm, and punching it. Good thing that you can still punch it. <laughs> and that is it for the human level playthrough of Virgil. It looks like there's two other levels between uh, Devil Hunter and Legendary Dark Knight. What's the costume I got? Oh! Oh! Well, what do you know? Well, what do you know? I got the- I got the red coat, Virgil! Red actually looks kinda good on him, not gonna lie. So probably when I next stream, we're gonna continue on the path of the legendary Dark Knight. It's tougher, bosses won't take bosses will take more to die, and they're probably gonna throw a lot more blitzes at me. And a lot more angry enemy placement. <laughs> yeah, I think it's human, devil hunter, heaven and hell, Dante must die, legendary dark knight, then hell and hell and the bloody palace. At least I think those are the, uh, difficulty settings. I have to look it up at some point. 